Um, the Eolean farm is literally on the edge of the Atlantic. It's, I don't know, is it 12 miles west of Castletown Bay? 12 miles west of Castletown Bay. Um, it was a, a livestock farm. And um, what most people would look out on a heavy bad day and only see the waves and only see the dark skies and you know wonder what sort of future there. And what Aileen did was look out and see is there potential in what's lapping around the edges of my farm? And that was the water. And it was seep water. And the business that Aileen has set up is Atlantic Sea Salt, the only Irish natural sea salt manufacturer. And the word artisan producer is a nice word, not manufacturer, in the country. And they pump the water into the sea. And they, they, they experimented with this, for example, my husband Michael was here as well, who had his own innovative business um, with abalone, using the same um, facility of the seawater off the coast of the farm. And the salt is, it's in an old, uh, well, it's very well, you know, uh, hygienic shed now, <laughs> but it's in, it's in kind of big, you know, basins of, of water, where with light and heat at a certain degree of temperature, the crystals, the, the salt crystals form on top of the water and drop down. And they know by, by trial and error when enough um, of the salt has been taken off the water. And then it has to be washed and cleaned or you know, just mm -hmm. and rinsed and then dried and then packaged. And you have this fabulous product, which is going down an absolute treat. When we were with um, Aileen, um, the product was being sold in 120 stores. Um, in Ireland, um, in Super Queen and Super Value. And that was only a couple of weeks ago, and it's now in 320 stores, and with the uh, Tesco looking to put it into um, 300 stores in the UK, the 300 top stores. Um, and, you know, again, it's, it's not, if, I, if that was me, I'd have made a seesaw and be able to say, God, now we can get this bought. But what really impressed us about Aileen around her kitchen table was looking at what else they're doing. Um, she has tied in with um, Kyo's farm, which again, family business, doing the potatoes, and one of their crisps range now has the Atlantic sea salt on it. Um, she's also got um, a variation of it where they have flavours infused in the salt, which includes like lemon oil and black pepper and aromatic garlic and chilli and prepica. So she's not just resting on her laurels, having developed the one product. There's a whole range of products now coming on board. <coughs> and all the time, with a young family, she still works two days a week as a receptionist for her local GP, because she says it gets her out of the house and gets her to meet the people and know what's going on in the community. And even, you know, all of that is what ties in. And so we're really delighted to uh, award Aileen O'Neill the winner of prize in the agribusiness and innovation category.